Hello everyone and welcome back to Besiege. I have gotten a ton of new vehicles to try and I'm only going to try a few today because what I really want to do is try a couple ideas that I've either A, gotten myself or B, have been uh, suggested to me by people. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to try a few of the vehicles and then I'm going to try and build a few. Okay, this is the first vehicle here. It is called the Slider, and I actually I really like this. You see, what they got done is they got half pipes. That's a new thing that's been added. I think I talked about it last time. They're really convenient for moving things around, like moving bombs or boulders or um, spike balls, perhaps. But basically what you do is you let go, and it slides all the way down there and kills them. So I'm going to press V. No. Um, 1. Hey, you got to press 1. And it's rolling the wrong way, damn it. How, how do I... How do I fix that? What is what is firing the cannon do? It fell off, damn it. Oh, hang on, is this thing not connected? Oh, this thing is not connected, so you can actually move it like this, so that's how you do it. Yeah, you gotta move back a little bit after you after you shoot it. Okay, okay, here we go. A drop of one, move back, move back. Damn it, you're wrong way, wrong way. Nope, go. Da oh no, 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 went to that. Da damn it. Oh, hang on, hang on, I got this. I got this in the bag. I didn't realize there was this. I thought this was a spinny block. That's not a spinny block right there. That's a turning block. So now you can actually drive forwards. And you can drop number one off. And it'll roll. Look at that. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Chase it down here. And it's going to roll off the end. And it's going to roll slowly towards these guys. They're not going to know what to do. So they're going to do nothing. <laughs> well. Well then. I think this may be what the cannon is for on the top. Let's see. I don't know how to fire the cannon. Press C. Nope, um, oh yeah, it's four. Four on the cannon. There. Ah, that is so smart. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna fire them all now. That's what we're gonna do, spin those down there. See, this is a lot more clever than I thought it was. I like this. Please send me more vehicles that are really clever like this. Okay, drop it. Like it's hot. There you go. Drop the next one. That's the good stuff. And then drop number three. And away it goes. They're all gonna roll down there together. I'm just going to watch, make sure nothing bad happens here. There you go, guys. Just roll that in there. Just like we're playing bowling, okay? Except not a very good game of it. Oh, we could do that. We could make a bowling thing. It could roll more. And it could do even better. I'm going to have to do that. Okay, there you go. So that that, that, that does that. We're going to go back. We're going to fire it. Let's see what happens. Oh, man. Complete destruction on this thing. That is super cool. There must be a lot of parts in this one because it's really laggy. I think we had to bring this one down to a lower speed. <gasps> oh, I get it. Okay, inside there, there's all kinds of spikes. So what you got to do is you got to drive down here and you got to introduce these little knights to the spikes. Let's bring it in for a second. I think something might have broke up. That's cool. No big deal. And they're all coming. We're going to open up. Oh, yeah. Get in my belly. Oh, crap. I need more fingers. Go on in and... Boom! We got you. Everybody is dead. Okay, this thing is called the lizard, and you can also move it right and left with the, uh... I don't know what buttons move it right and left. Some of these buttons here somewhere. <laughs> move the actual things in front so that you can turn. And it actually just runs around. Okay. Oh, is that because with gears you can actually place them on, uh... You can actually place things on the outside of them? I don't think you can normally do that with, um... With normal wheels, so that's kind of cool. That's a new thing you can make with the new update. And there's two guys left here. Let me see if I can get them. Yeah, I can. This is probably the simplest of all the vehicles. I don't know why it's doing that. It's kind of weird. Oh, wait, wrong button. There we go. <laughs> all it does is put up the middle finger. I guess one of them is on a, a faster turn. The other. Oh, no, the other one doesn't turn at all. I get it. So you pull it up, and then you got a middle finger. Yeah, fuck you. Okay. Hey. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Fuck you, man. Fuck you. Oh, there's a flamethrower on it. There's a flamethrower. How do I use it? Yeah. Okay, we gotta, we gotta start over. And, oh, wrong way. And fuck you. Nobody's dying. There you go. Now people are dying. Only some of them. The rest of them don't really care. Cool. This one I really like because somebody sent this to me and they told me that it can actually beat every level. And I believe them because it's it's really simple. It's just a minimalist catapult that you uh, throw with a button. Um, L? Yep. And it catapults things, and it should be able to beat all the levels. Um, it, it can even beat the other one where you have to pick up uh, pick up wood, which is one of the complicated ones to try and beat with this with a, a normal vehicle. You should pick up wood, but you can do it with this thing because there's a grabber on the end, so that's kind of cool. Other than that, I don't really feel like trying to beat all the levels, but uh, yeah. Okay, this thing is called the slicer. I don't really know how you're supposed to control it, but if you just kind of 
tap it now and then, you seem to be able to move it over places, and everybody dies. That's the way I like my machines. Okay, this thing is kind of crazy, guys. It's called a snake, and it can break. That rhymed. It wasn't supposed to. <laughs> it's really freaking touchy, man. It's got so many different um, different hinges on it, and you can you can you can drive around really quick. And you can, you can shit. Now I'm two snakes. That's all, no big deal. Whatever, whatever. Grab someone. Do I got someone? Hold on. I'm in three pieces now. But I do have a dude, and you can drop him off at pressing V, right? Yeah. There you go. Okay. <laughs> now there's just three snakes driving around wreaking havoc. Lovely. Ooh. Now this. This thing looks kind of cool. Ah. Uh, I think there was some controls for this. I think it may have been Z, X, and C or something like that. Let me see. Z. X go up faster and C to climb slower. Okay, it, it it actually it actually lowers you. Okay, that's cool. Anyway, yeah, it's got some extra it's got some extra propellers that spin when you want them to spin, so you can actually get places. And it's yeah, it's called whoa. Just drop some bombs. Okay, those are on the arrow keys. How do I turn? Okay, I got it. I got it. It's numpad. Okay, it's numpad. This this is gonna be good. Look at that. I don't know how this works. I don't know where the controls are going. Oh oh, there's a back thing on it. It's probably the back thing in the side. Oh my god, this is using like a uh, gyroscope thingies. Look, the wheels actually spin and cause it to rotate in directions. I don't really know how this stuff works because I'm not super clever when it comes to uh, when it comes to how helicopters work, but look at it. Wow, this thing works. You can, you can drive it around and it's really freaking good. Drop down a little bit further. You gotta be able to see this crap. Here we go, turn, 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 and drop the bombs. Woohoo! <laughs> Damn, this thing is awesome. And remember, guys, anything I use in this video, I will put in a uh, a folder, and it will be in the description in case you want to actually download these yourself, okay? Cool. I'm afraid to try and use this thing. It's called Tentacle Dick, and it is made of a lot of parts, and I feel like it's just going to shit its pants. It can't even move. You move it, and it lags, okay? I can only imagine how bad it's going to be once it starts. Oh, God. Everything is broken on me. No, oh, it's kind of working. It's kind of working. There goes the tentacle dick. Press H. Should I press H? Oh, I press H. Oh my gosh. Okay. You de definitely don't want to have tentacle dick coming at your face at any point in your life. Yeah, so that that's that thing. Okay, this is two-piece. He's literally just two pieces. I should probably bring him back up to speed here. There we go. Okay, two-piece. Show me what you got. It doesn't do anything. Oh, it rolls! It can roll places! <laughs> or can it? Yeah, it kind of does. It kind of rolls. This is the most useless vehicle ever. I didn't think it was actually going to be made of... I thought it was going to be like two different vehicles. They sent it to me and were like, it's self-explanatory. It's two-piece. <laughs> I was like, okay. But yeah, they meant it's literally just like two pieces put together. Okay, <laughs> we'll move on. And this is called the Wasp. I really don't know what's happening here, but it looks really freaking cool. Okay, 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 I get it. I thought it was gonna fly. I don't I don't think it can fly. It can just drive around. And pressing L does Oh, it kinda pokes it in and out, huh? Okay. Alright. It's a it's a wasp doing a little dance. Honestly though, honestly this thing looks kinda cool. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This thing looks really cool. And it and it's and it, it can drive around. It actually works. I like the the way that people take the ideas in this game and they uh they come up with these really weird uh, ways to actually do things like put things on their sides, you know um, Make it so that it's no longer just uh, wheels touching the ground like normal like make really weird ways for wheels to touch the ground You know by putting them putting them all sideways and stuff I don't know if I'm making much sense, but my point is vehicles are cool and thank you for making them. Yeah Okay guys, that is the end of the custom vehicles that I want to show you today Now we're gonna try and build something that I think will be really awesome if I can get it to work we're going to try and build a human catapult that was suggested to me by someone in the comments and uh, I thought it was a wonderful idea. So let's try and build that and we'll see how it works. Okay, so this thing actually points at the ground and it looks like it might be at a height that I can use, okay? If that's the case, we are getting somewhere really quick with this thing. Is it just me or does it seem like things got a lot weaker? I mean, I know I'm not in invincible mode right now, but still, it feels like everything is really weak all of a sudden. I'm going to put on invincible mode for this, okay? Because I feel like there's going to be a lot of problems as it is. There you go. Look at it. Look at the amount of strain it's putting on this. Is it because it's heavy on the top? I honestly have never seen wobble like this before. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll brace it a little bit anyway. Jeez. So we should actually be able to just go boom and fire people now. It may need to actually come back a bit so it can spin a little bit more. I'm not really sure. We might need to tweak the design a little bit. And we're going to need to put another ballast on here or something. 
or somewhere on it. We'll drive forwards. Act inconspicuous. Wait for me. Wait for me. Get everything out of the way here. And get ready. Shit is about to get heavy. And this is not an Eminem song. Go! Okay, we got someone. We're gonna drive him over here, let's just say. Okay, first attempt. Here we go. L and V. Wow! Oh, nope. Nope. Didn't didn't work that well at all. I got another one. Ugh. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> I actually grabbed him twice then. Nice. Come on, guys. Come on. Oops. Sorry. Gotcha. Ah! Okay, okay, this is the problem we always have with things. These guys don't want to go in the air, okay? They don't want to do that. Also, I think we need to fling them further. Okay, we need we need to get to the top. With something like this, it'll still go. Nice and far, and it can come back as well, and come back down. Cool, cool. Um, we gotta make them even better springers. Spr springers, Jerry Springers over here. Elasticity on four. Whoa, that's a lot of elasticity. I don't care, it can't break, whatever. You ready? Oh, didn't even make much of a difference. Touch you. Touch you. There we go. Okay, I got someone. So, fling them up. Oh my gosh, they're so freaking heavy. What the hell did you eat, man? Oh, I guess I guess this might not work. I mean, I should have I should have known. Should have known. Should have known this thing wasn't going to work. There's always another option though. There's always another route we can take here, guys, okay? This one is a bit more complicated, okay? It involves steering blocks. Okay, I don't know if this will work at all, but I'm going to try it. If you combine steering blocks together, you should be able to make an ultra-fast steer, right? You should be able to turn extra fast. So, if I bring it up like this, okay, and I uh, and I bring it in with all steering blocks, it might, might just work, okay? See, they're spinning pretty fast now, okay? I obviously cannot <laughs> assign them the way they're assigned right now, but, but they're spinning. Okay, I just realized something really interesting about this, guys. When you actually put these many spinners on... It actually changes so that these blocks are actually now right in the middle, rather than being on the sides. And you can still connect them by the look of it. I don't know what's going to happen here. Okay, they fell off. No big deal. Ah, see? And now we can go Z. Whoa! Yes! This is what I wanted. <laughs> okay. Let's try this. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good, I promise. I shouldn't make promises I can't keep, but I promise! Holy shit, this thing has power. Whoa, whoa, look at all that power. Look at all that power. <laughs> stop. Please stop. You're, this is seriously out of control. I gotta reverse it. Hang on, reverse. Stop, stop, stop. I can do it. I can't, I can't fix this. I've created a monster. Okay, so, oh, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. This way, that's the way it has to go. This is going to be weird, because I don't know if these guys will even get up. I'm pretty sure it just stops you automatically before you can actually throw these guys anywhere. But if it doesn't work, it doesn't work, okay? At least we tried. Okay, you're grabbed. Throw. Oh! Oh, it did it! It did it! It actually worked! Oh, I'm so happy! This is... I'm so proud of myself right now. Yes, he may have died, but at least you can throw him, okay? Maybe you could just kill him first, if you wanted, really. Okay? That'd be just as good. You still get to throw the bodies. Watch this. You ready? You gotta press V and... Oh, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way, sorry. Ah, look at him go! <laughs> okay, hang on. We're gonna make this thing drop a little bit faster first, okay? Then everything will be okay. There you go. Okay, I'm bringing you over here, okay? You got a town to wreak havoc on. Okay, ready? Aim. And... Wait, is it X or... I think it's Z. Z! Woo! Woo! He didn't go anywhere. <laughs> What I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna focus the camera on him, okay? So we can see exactly what happens here. And go! Whee! <laughs> I need to get him to hit a building! I need to do it! He's actually alive, guys! He is actually alive for once! Holy crap! <laughs> I'm having way too much fun with this. No! No! He died. What am I doing? I can I can just use the townspeople. I can kill the townspeople uh with with themselves. I can kill I can kill their town with them. How awesome does that sound? I'm coming for you, buddy. I'm coming. Whoa, shit. Focus on him. Dana. 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 Da, 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 da. We've made contact. We have made contact. We're actually lined up right there to hit a house, okay? Ready to hit a house, buddy? You ready? Whee! Oh, God, you're so far away now. That is not what I'm in. You look like you had a good time, though. We have to get him to actually run away from the town so we don't actually hit the bombs, okay? So just aim to this guy. Bring it down. Drive towards him. Don't touch anything you don't want to touch. I break. I broke some things. It's fine. Grab. Got him. Grab. Shit. 
You ruined it. You ruined everything. There's one cottage left over here. Hold on. Hold on. We can we can still do something with our lives. We gotta be very careful with when we release him. What? <laughs> oh, he looks terrified. Please help me. And go. Oh, so close. He was so close to hitting that time. It's coming for you, buddy. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, you couldn't escape it. You couldn't escape it. Oh, your house is left, huh? Your house. This is the one you're standing next to. I bet this is the one you actually live in with, like, a wife and a family. Let's destroy it. Wah! What? What? Jesus! Jesus, I'm sorry! Your name is Jesus now, by the way. And... Fire! Oh, damn it! Damn you! You're never gonna be... You're never gonna amount to anything. You suck. You're lucky you survived that explosion, buddy. <laughs> Many other people are not so lucky as you. I don't know how you managed to dodge all that debris, but you did. There you go, buddy. There you go. Oh, look. Look at that nice little windmill. I bet you'd love to hit it, wouldn't you? I bet you'd love to hit it and destroy it. Okay, let's do it then. If you say so. And go. Oh, you're so far. Damn you. Okay, I, I don't know. I, I think what's happening here is uh, it's moving them too fast. I'd hate to have to say that, but I think it's true. Can we just like bring like w maybe one of them down to one? Just to decrease the speed a little bit. Like, I, I don't I don't need this much. I think, I think it actually made a little bit of a difference because it doesn't seem to turn quite as fast now, okay? Just grab a guy. Grab a partner, any partner. Preferably the partner closest to you so you don't have to wait for this shit. It's done, we're good. Bring him over here. Turn it. Throw it. Okay, it was very close. Very close, I think we have a problem. I think we have a bit of a problem here, buddy. I think we've created a death machine. And the death machine is leaving. This death machine is your death machine. This death ma Whoa! Whoa, you can fall off the edge of the map! Did you know there's an edge of the map in this game? Because I didn't. Okay, I've decided to try one last thing, guys. I think it'll work. We grab a guy. Okay, he died. That's fine. It doesn't even matter now. We gotta put on full speed again. But what we need to do is we need to actually put it in slow motion, like 5%, okay? 5% should do it. Now... We should be able to let go with precisely the right time, right? It should go up with Z. Okay, it's going up. Look at that. So it should go up. Okay. And then we should let go with V at just the right time. <gasps> oh, man. Looks like we got it. Looks like we got it. Is he going to do it? Is he going to hit the house? I think he's going to hit the... He might go over the house. I think he's just going to slightly go over the house. Oh, so close. And throw. Ooh, bit too high. Bit too high. Damn it. I wish you could reverse time in this game. That would be really useful. Oh, he's gonna miss the freaking house again. No! Ah! He pretty much touched the roof. Yep. Yep. And throw. Yes! We got it. We got it, guys. He's gonna hit it. Oh, boom! And it's destroyed. I just destroyed your building with a dead body. Checkmate. Okay, guys, I was going to try some other designs, but I think it's probably best to end this video here. It's probably going to be pretty long with all the trial and error that I had. So thank you very much for watching this episode of Besiege. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>